They're real Australian bushies. Yeah, I know, but, you know, like... drovers on horseback. Their faithful dog loping the shadow of their horse. In dry as a bone coats. The kind of person that could turn their hand to anything. You know your problem, don't you? You've seen Man from Snowy River too many times. Yeah, I suppose you're right. I suppose people like that don't even exist anymore. dog out of the door before someone trips over him. Hey, Skip, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Stay there, then. Stay. Stay. Go home, then. Off you go. Die for me, that dog. It smells like he already has. So, Thel, what are you planning on doing now that you're sold up? Oh, I don't know, Clance. I'm thinking of going. Going? Going where? North. I want to go north. North? Yeah? North is good. Mind you, south has got a bit to recommend it too. Wouldn't know. Never been south. I hear west is all right. Yeah, west. West is good. Except there was a bloke in here the other day who said west was a bit dry. It's good, though. Dry seems to suit it. I suppose so. <sighs> Mind you, it wouldn't bother with east. Nah. <laughs> Burn east, have you? Once, when I was a girl. Didn't like it, though. What was it like, east? Well, it was a bit like here, with a caravan park. I can understand you wanting to move on. I never stay in one place for any length of time. You've been here 17 years. You know what they say about me? Clancy's gone a droving, and we don't know where he are. They should have looked in the pub. There you go, missus. That should keep the cow out. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, well, thanks, Clancy. I didn't know you were a fencer. I thought you were a drover. Well, you'll learn to turn your hand to anything in a bush. <laughs> Come on, Skip. Come on, boy. Oh, gone already, eh? Good dog. Where's my mind, that animal? <laughs> <laughs> Clancy? Yes, missus. How are those herbs of yours? They've gone. The cow ate them. Ate them, you say? Yes. What about the fence? Well, apparently she ate that too. Yeah? Mm-hmm. And then she ate all my herbs. Oh, God. All of them, you say? Yes, that's right. Now, Clancy, you told me the fence would keep the cow out of the garden. Uh, point of order here. I didn't say it would. I said it should. Oh, God. But that cow is obviously a very determined animal. It's a cow of a cow, that cow. Clancy, what do you propose to do about it? About what? The fence. You say the cow ate all your herbs. Every last one of yes, them. Yes, that's right. You won't be needing a fence then, will you? Evening. <sighs> yeah, he, he's, he's here. He's there. Hang on a minute, Clance! He nearly killed a man. I reckon I got him. You could at least give me time to get clear. No, I gotta move fast with possums, mate. What are you whining about? He missed you, didn't he? What the hell are you doing? I was getting rid of the possum for the missus. Did she ask you to do that? Nah, but she'll be tickled pink. And I feel I should do something for her, you know, after that business with the fence. Hell of a shot, Clance. Do anything for you? Yes, you can. You can bloody well don't, explain. Don't, don't, don't let me handle this. You're angry. Oh, you're damn right. I'm angry. I'm furious. When you're angry, you say things you regret. Okay, okay. You handle it. Now, Clancy. Oh, 
Oh, you moronic clod. Do you know what you've done? Do you? I just... You have shot our wall. Yeah, but I was aiming at the possum. And you missed. I'm surprised you managed to hit the wall. But then you weren't aiming at the wall, were you? Fair go. Don't you fair go me. Do you know you also shot our water pipes? Yeah, well, anyone can make a mistake. A mistake? A, a mistake? Did it ever occur to you you might like to fix my water pipe? Well, we, we, we didn't notice in the dark. Dark? Why was it dark? B because of the power. What about the power? Well, you haven't got any of that either. Oh, oh God. Well, now, of course, the tank would be empty. The t what tank is this? Water tank. <laughs> oh, you city people. <laughs> Don't you laugh at us. Don't you dare laugh at us, you inept idiot. You don't even know what that means, do you? It means you never get anything right. It means you're a failure. But you've always been a failure, haven't you? You can't build a fence. You shoot holes in people's walls and you've lost all our water. But that's nothing new, is it? You even lost the famous lost herd. The lost herd? No wonder your dog won't listen to you. Even he knows you're useless. Well, it's true. You all know it's true. Admit it. Clancy, you come down from there right now. I'm going to kill myself. Clancy, this is no way to solve your problems. Yeah, you got a perfectly good gun at home. That's a hell of a thing to say to a man. Well, he has. What's going on here? He says he's going to kill himself. Good luck. It looks like we're elected. Oh, no, no, look, I'll, I'll go. You stay here in case he jumps. Someone will have to pull him out of the river. You be careful. Well, the big worry is, if he jumps, he's liable to miss the river. Clancy! I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said what I did. No, you're right. I'm a failure. I've always been a failure. Nonsense. I'm sure you've done something right. Sometime. I've failed all my life. I've even failed at ending my life. I can't even commit suicide. Why should you commit suicide? I'm the one that stuffed it all up. If I don't, I just won't be able to face anyone. Well, if you do, I won't be able to face anyone. So what are we going to do? Damn it. We'll both commit suicide. Well, it'll solve everything. You do that for me? Of course I would, Clancy. What are friends for? You know, Mrs. Spencer, I value that deeply. Clancy, we'll do it together. You and me. <sighs> just like Butch and Sundance, isn't it? <laughs> Sandy, what are you doing? I'm just committing suicide, dear. <laughs> okay, come on. Hello, Clance. What have you been up to? Just committed suicide, Tal. How was it? Piece of piss. I don't know why everyone makes such a big thing of it. Clance, you're still alive. <laughs> <laughs>